Hey guys, I'm going to take my very first look at player-owned ports. I just now logged in, three minutes ago. And I'm actually recording this one live. Just so, I'm testing out a new feature. My old recorder didn't have this option for some reason. So I'm going to test this out now and see how well it goes. If it doesn't go well, then I guess I will just do something different. But if it goes well, I can just live record things from now on. So, player owned ports, just north of Port Serum, they said. Let's go this way then. Okay, I am not seeing anything north. Okay, so we're running south then. Um, I only have one of the 99's required to use this, or 90 plus is required to use this, but I can at least do something here, I guess. I don't feel like getting 90 slay, thieving, prayer, etc. But, I do have 90 plus room crafting, so I'm going to go in there and use that. Okay, I don't see anything down here either. So there'd be a portal around here? I see a portal actually. Portal, portal, portal. Okay, I'm back. My game crashed. Actually hasn't done that since uh well since I got this new computer that records in such great quality, but then my stupid movie maker makes it low quality again. Um so I turned on the music because I just watched the first half of this and that's a little bit too loud. Ah, oh, there's the portal. Not really north port serum, it's right in the middle of it, but eh, that's tag X for you. Okay, so in I go. It's taking forever to load right now. Huh. Looks like there's a little tutorial to play out here. So let's talk to this guy. Hello there. Welcome to my port. Such that it is. I know it's not much to look at anymore, but there was a time when this was a bustling hive of commerce. It's what it looks we like now. We haven't seen any trade okay, since the sea much. monsters started attacking. The port's fallen onto hard times, and the eastern lands have grown quiet. Huh? was that? Oh well. Well, you can certainly handle yourself, can't you? Name's Strum. John Strum. Who were those people? Why do you bring them here? Oh, I always have someone chasing me. Mercenary soothsayers, sea singers, cons. I seem to collect pursuers. I must say, I didn't expect to be chased all the way to the west. But I can't blame them for trying. We must talk. Meet me in the bar later. I can't wait. Oh, well, that got the blood rushing, didn't it? Can't think when I last felt so alive. Okay. And you heard what she said, didn't you? It's possible again to travel across the seas. The sea monsters that have plagued the oceans must be gone. That means the whole market's opened up. For years I've been living in the shadows, just getting out, eating, going to sleep, day in, day out. I wish for the life I once had, running this place. I want to feel that hustle and bustle, feel that energy again, but I'm too old for all that. You? Well, you could do it. I've heard of your skills. From who? Everyone's heard of your skills. Would you help an old man out? What do I have to lose? 
I know it's a lot to ask of you, but just think of the rewards. They say there are scrolls out there. Forgotten scrolls that hold the secrets of forging ancient armor. With a ship, you could hunt those down. Come on. What do you say? Pot? Sure. Excellent. Excellent. Let's get down to business. Our port is falling apart. If we're going to raise the funds to restore it, we need to send ships eastwards as quickly as possible. Go and talk to our navigator, Duncan, in the office. He's a little peculiar, but capable. He'll be able to get you started. Thank you. I've got a good feeling about you. Wow, Jagex really likes to make the uh, characters in these things drone on and on. You could have just stopped with talk to Duncan. But, oh well. Let's see what Duncan has to say. And who may you be? The navigator. Um, I see. Well, it's about time someone took this place in hand. I've written numerous complaints, but the only thing that led to was John taking down the complaint box. <laughs> We're in bad shape. We only have one ship that's seaworthy and barely any crew. John kept on one captain, thank Guthix, although from what I can tell, he's a drunk. Why does Jagex like Guthix so much? As the only member of the team who doesn't spend all day in the bar, I've been doing a bit of prep work in case of this eventuality. We should spend more time in the bar, then. Ah, well, there's an island not far from here called Twilight, the most western of all the Washanko Isles. There's meant to be a ready supply of bamboo there. Twilight? I really hope this isn't named after the Twilight series. I propose we send out a ship with what crew we have and collect as much bamboo as we can. Hopefully it'll be enough to fix up this office and run another ship. This office isn't even made out of bamboo. What's he planning? Here are the details, um, Portmaster. You can access the Voyage interface at any time by clicking the Voyage button in the menu at the top of your screen. Click the Voyage button now. Okay. Voyages. What now? You currently have no voyage selected. Click on the basic to select it. Oh, yeah, that's amazing. Open up the crew list to assign captains and a crew to your current boat. Guess I'll take this guy. And this guy. Come on. Oh. Man, that was hard. The partner tells you resources are needed to get the port back in action. Approximate ETA soon. You're done here for now. Click the close button to exit the shipyard. Uh, okay. Voyage generally lasts a certain number of real-world hours or minutes. This one will complete when you when you progress in the tutorial. Oh, okay, cool. Return to the navigator and let him know the ship's underway. I have to return from here to here. Okay. Um, excellent. Well, that's the first ship set. Great. You can check on your ship's progress by clicking on the ship icon in the side panel. Find the partner when you are ready to continue. Okay, let's go this way. You sent off a ship? Already? Well, I'm mightily impressed. You should be. Hang on. Do my ears deceive me? Already? Cool. Partner tells you resources are needed to get the port back in action. Get results. The voyage achieved its objectives. Awesome. You're done here for now. Okay. Voyage successful. You've gained a quantity of bamboo and a Wushanko currency. Chimes. You should go and tell the partner the good news. Man, that's a long walk. That's quite the haul. I reckon we've got enough bamboo there to fix the old bar. Why isn't he talking all of a sudden? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll deal with Duncan. Okay.
Lovely to meet you, my salty little oyster. <laughs> I'm Cerula. Who are you? You're a little bit purple for me. She certainly needs a bit of love and attention. Well, how can I help? Why, that's wonderful news. We should get on it at... Um, why did I just leave the bar? Back to you, I guess. Wonderful, wonderful! The place looks far better. Still none of the stuff is made out of bamboo. Oh well. Go and tell John the good news. I think he's in the office. I heard him arguing with Duncan. <sighs> Off to the office. How dare you! I've never been so insulted! Oh. Oh, we finally get some resources, and you waste it on your watering hole. That should have gone on the office. We need to be able to manage multiple ships. Well, I can't pretend to understand, but I'll defer to your judgment, Portmaster. Yeah, I'm the Portmaster. Anyway, on to business. I was thinking about that adventurer who turned up at the port. We could use someone with her skills. Might open up new opportunities. Mr. Brothel? Have a word. She's probably still in the bar. <sighs> Everyone's always in the bar. Except for that port. What's with these people? They're all dressed in weird clothes. That's where that lady looks like Ariane. Ooh, upstairs. Lovely to see you, darling. And there's that floating floor what over there. What can I do for you? Why, certainly. Special food. Now back to this. Start voyage. What exactly do we need to smuggle? There's no laws anywhere except for Karamja. I'm gonna keep calling it that. I'm not gonna call it Karamya. Karamya. And this is the very nice floating floor. Actually, all these floors are floating. Is this a graphical glitch, or is Jagex just lazy lately? That should be filled in with more than just a black box with white lines. Oh well. <sighs> Where am I going now? Back to you, partner. I reckon they'll show up most days. You two have much in common. Similar skills, for one thing. They won't be able to... St Your ship has returned, Port Master. Again? Refitted office. Yes. Darn.
It looks no different. It got a better paint job. Ah, excellent, Portmaster. With the upgraded office, we can now run two ships oh. at once. Looks like we'll be needing new crew. Maybe even another captain. You take the helm from here, partner. Good luck. Any questions? We'll be happy to help. I'm at your disposal. Well, then go dispose yourself. Check items one. about the ship too. Small crate of food. Chances of success are low. What am I trying to do? <laughs> Seems like a good system, but it's... Troy really didn't tell me enough. Ship name creator. <sighs> Can't just type in my own? The Fervent Ship? What kind of lame name is that? The Fervent Roger. Okay, well, I'm not really sure what more I can do here. Oh, wait, I need to put the stupid weathered rigging back on. Fine. How can I start a voyage? No, because the ship still has no crew. Okay, well, I guess that's it then. Um. Yep, bye guys.